Hi, my name is Zachary Flammeltz and I'm a BD2K Lynx Research Fellow in the Mayan Lab at Mount Sinai. My project is called Mod Enricher, which is an expansion of the Enricher platform for model organisms. Biological data of different types is being stored and cataloged in a variety of different locations. There is a continued effort to consolidate data for the purpose of integration, hypothesis testing, and inference. Data collected through a variety of experiments can be integrated by shared properties. For example, gene knockout experiments often result in an observed phenotype, and it may be that the same phenotype is observed when other genes are knocked out in the same system. Those genes share a property, namely the phenotype observed. The gene matrix transposed, or GMT file, is a powerful data organization format for accessing the shared properties of gene sets. GMTs contain tab-separated lines where each line consists of a gene set name or term, a description, and then a list of genes. Each new line represents a gene set for that library. Here is an example GMT from Wiki Pathways for C. elegans. Many biological experiments result in the generation of differentially expressed gene or protein lists. Enrichment analysis is a method for identifying collective properties of such identified lists by comparing them to existing lists created from prior knowledge organized into gene set libraries. Enricher is a popular gene list enrichment analysis tool that currently contains over 200,000 annotated lists organized into over 125 gene set libraries. Enricher was developed as an integrative web-based and mobile application for doing enrichment analysis. The current version of Enricher only supports mammalian organisms, namely human, mouse, and rat, limiting accessibility for investigators that study other model organisms. We present Mod Enricher, an expansion of the Enricher platform for four model organisms, fly, worm, yeast, and fish. We also built a landing page for accessing all the Enricher toolkit. Fly Enricher is an expansion of the Enricher platform for Drosophila melanogaster. Among databases that store species data for a variety of organisms, we made use of curated fly datasets from Drosophila specific databases Flybase and DROID. Worm Enricher is an expansion of the Enricher platform for C. elegans. Again, we made use of curated worm datasets from Wormbase. Yeast Enricher is an expansion of the Enricher platform for Saccharomyces cerevisiae. Fish Enricher is an expansion of the Enricher platform for Danio Rario. With the specific organism enrichers being built off the same platform, we wanted to facilitate cross-species research. Additionally, the original Enricher has over 125 libraries built from a wide variety of data sources. This represents a large knowledge base that can now be tapped for researchers studying other organisms. It must be noted that just because two genes are orthologs does not mean that they maintain similar functional roles or that they are associated with the same processes. However, we believe that allowing cross-species querying will serve as an additional resource in attempting to understand novel results. Existing gene set libraries can then be used to themselves predict new annotations and associations for genes. I use gene co-expression data to predict novel go term annotations for fish and fly genes. I will now describe the method for making the predictions. First, GEO and SRA experiments using HiSeq 2000, HiSeq 2500, and NextSeq 500 platforms for a species are processed in a uniform way to generate a matrix of gene counts for each experiment. Then, gene counts are normalized using quantile normalization. Next, normalized counts are used to create a gene-gene correlation matrix. The average correlation of a gene to each gene in an existing gene set is calculated for all genes. Then, the average correlations for each term are scaled using z-score. Finally, the z-scores are sorted in decreasing order, and the top breaking genes are predicted to be associated with that term. Here is a plot of the prediction of term assignment for one fly gene, Bloom syndrome helicase, for the Gene Ontology Molecular Function Library. The plot was made by sorting the z-scores for the gene in decreasing order. A zero or one is given to each term depending on whether the gene is associated with that term in the training set or not, and then the y-value represents the cumulative sum of the binary scores as you move down the sorted term list. 
Here is a violin plot of all the AUC values for each gene when trained and tested on the gene ontology libraries for both fly and fish. The average AUCs fall between 0.68 and 0.76. In summary, we present fly enricher, worm enricher, fish enricher, and yeast enricher for public use, each with a number of libraries built from existing and predicted associations. Each enricher maintains its own independent functionality, as well as an integrated functionality through the ortholog conversion tool and enricher landing page. These new resources are potential tools for hypothesis generation for biologists that study model organisms. Thank you.